it's been a very controversial area for many many years and uh, what Ricardo and I are trying to um, present in here is the the notion that after a decade or so in which the hypothesis that there are progenitor cells in the pancreas that may contribute to regeneration after that hypothesis had been discredited for a number of years uh, it is now making a comeback and part of that comeback is actually our work together we have uh, demonstrated that there are progenitors in the pancreas, in the adult pancreas, not only in mice but also in humans, which is a very important uh, clarification, and that those cells can potentially be stimulated uh, through pharmacological means to induce regeneration in patients. That's the, the whole the holy grail that we are trying to pursue here. And um, we present uh, in this paper the opposite views as well. Uh, there's uh, some contentiousness in the field because some people claim that there are not stem cells in the pancreas. Um, we believe that many of the techniques used to that uh, to reach that conclusion were flawed and we present the pros and cons of each one of these uh, hypotheses but clearly our work and the work of others is actually adding uh, to the notion that we have stem cells in the pancreas in the adult pancreas and that we can potentially exploit those cells uh, to our benefit for the treatment of type 1 diabetes.